Hi there! Today I'm going to show you how to use the mobile time clock. While this video may be more specifically targeted to a provider, it is still important for vendors to know how it works so they can help out when needed. As a provider, I can log into my profile using the app or I can click on the link from the mobile time clock email. When I log into my profile on LocumSmart, to the left I'll see some options including time clock. I'll click on the time clock. Since the provider is most likely using their mobile phone, we'll look at it from the mobile phone perspective. It basically looks the same on a computer, the screen is just wider. So the first thing I see at the top is facility. Now I may have multiple facilities available depending on my assignment, so I'll want to make sure I'm clocking in at the right location. I'll choose facility 1000. Now that I've chosen my facility, I'll come down here, click on the plus icon, then click clock in. Now I can choose what hour type, whether it's regular, callback, or orientation. For holiday or overtime pay, I'll still select regular. Then I'll click clock in. You can see now it says shift in progress, and the next option is to clock out. One feature to note is the mobile time clock will also track the global location on my phone to confirm where I'm at. This information will be visible to the vendor after I submit my timesheet. Once I have completed my shift, I'll click on the clock out button and I have the option to add any notes, tolls, mileage, and can adjust my clock in time if needed. Then I'll click clock out. Here's the log of my clock in and clock out. If I need to make any changes to this, I can just click on the edit button, go back in and change my times. Then click save and close. The next option, if I've forgotten to clock in or out or I was doing the on-call shift, I can still add my time using the mobile time clock. So I'll come down here, click on the plus icon, then select previous shift. Here I can go in, select my hour type, the clock in time, clock out time, any additional notes, add the toll amount, as well as any mileage. Now those hours have been added to my log. Let's add some hours for on call. Click on the plus, go to on call. So you'll notice by default, it's already set for 24 hours. So I just need to put in the rest of those times. So I'll say 6 a.m to 6 a.m. Add any notes, then hit save and close. And now you'll see my on-call hours have been added to the log. So at the bottom it will show the totals of my accumulated hours. So we can see here's 10 hours for regular, 24 hours for on-call. Once all my times are added I'll come up here and click on submit timesheet. We do recommend that a provider submit their timesheet once a week for ongoing assignments. It'll ask for a confirmation. And now we're done. I hope this information has been helpful. If you have any questions, please feel free to contact our live chat team or email support at locumsmart.net. Thank you and have a great day.